the mother for Mother's Day. Do you love it? She's still there. It's not getting close to the barn. So I'm assuming she's eating back there. But every time I come, I'm, gonna, I'm trying to catch her off guard. But she's already looking at me. I'm gonna check her ligaments again. She's been a little bit more friendly. She definitely doesn't have anything. Today I was able to feel a little bit on this side, but there's nothing there right now. But I'm going to stick around and see if I see her have any contractions. As you can see, she really wants my attention and she hasn't been wanting any attention. She would not let me touch her yesterday like this. I guess she's starting to realize that something is happening. So, she just wants some company. She was sitting here chewing the con. She had her in a hook but Annabelle is beating her up so badly that I'm going to try to convince her to go into the kitty stall come on ma come on I think I think come on ma come here come here I think she's having a contraction yeah she's having one come here ma we're gonna go, okay? We're gonna go. Come on. Come on. Come on. You can do it. No, 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 no. This is gonna be interesting having her go into the stall. We're gonna go in. Go in. Come on, Athene. Go in. Good girl. I'm gonna bring you food, okay? Annabelle has been beating her up a lot and uh, even though I don't see that she's like an active labor I'm gonna separate her because that was Annabelle she's having a terrible day today and she's beating up everyone especially Athene and I refill the water because I'm constantly trying to put like more fresh water and, and you know for them so it's not getting hot and Annabelle wouldn't let a theme drink. And that's when I was like, well, no, that's where I'm, draw the, I'm drawing the line. So it's 5 p.m. and uh, she's starting to be a little bit more focused. She's more posty. It seems like she's... Uh, agitated if you look at her breathing so who knows how long this is gonna be but she seems to be progressing at least that's that's all I can see right now I decided to take everyone to the back room where the food is or where I feed them and avoid all the constant drama that was happening outside 
it was just overwhelming and she you know being a first time mom she was kind of progressing and then she would stop and you know get scared because everyone is beating each other up and now she's uh, very calm despite the fact that the other ones are kind of screaming every once in a while but she's starting to stretch her leg and she's making noises like she wants to start pushing or something who knows it's um, 540 I've always read that you shouldn't leave a bucket of water while they are in labor but when I'm around and I'm gonna keep an eye on the dough through the camera or I'm gonna be here I try to leave it in because in my experience they do want water especially when it's around this time of the year that it's hot they do want water she's been drinking water since she got in here she was eating then she turned around and she decided to sit like I don't know if she has pressure or what it is but she was eating just fine I was about to leave because she's been eating for the last 10 minutes and I thought definitely she's not near but look at that leg this is what your mama does when she's in labor she wants to be on my lap and since she doesn't fit she sits right there yes this is what your mama does You are your child, your mom's child, for sure. Oh my goodness. Oh my There's goodness. the adder. I don't even know what time it is. It's 7.10. And now she decided to be loud. Stopped the groaning and laying down and all that stuff. As you can see, she just can't make up her mind so she's also grinding her teeth I'll try to show you as she's speaking but she lost her tooth the one in the middle <laughs> now she doesn't want to show it show me like I'm not proud of it like she has tiny teeth on the side but She's gonna get her, her one big in the middle. I know. And so when she's trying to talk, she rests her tongue in the hole that is in the middle, and it's so cute. She, yeah, I know. Maybe you can see it right there. Yeah. Oh, goodness gracious. I think it's the second tooth that is gonna come in that hole because she does have a bigger one growing. Okay, so it's 9.30 and uh, she's started to be loud about an hour ago. I left I made dinner, I ate, I did dishes, kept checking on her on the camera, and she's grinding her teeth, as you can hear. But we'll see. What I'm going to do in the next 30 minutes is kind of see how many contractions she's having every hour. So I'm going to keep my phone with me and try to see how often she's getting contractions and then based on that decide if I should just go to bed
mother for Mother's Day. Do you love it? Mm. I do love it. I think you're going to be a good mom. Yes, ma'am. Yes, ma'am. I'm picking up poop right now. So you've been pooping. You've been pooping, girlfriend. Okay, you push. Come on. You can do this. Good job. Come on. Look. You have a baby. And he is, or she is so tiny. Baby. Say hi, Mom. It's so nice to meet you. I was in there for a while. I wanted to come out. And you were like, no, no, no. You stay there, baby. Oh, is there another one coming? Look at that cute baby. Look at the cute, cute baby. Hello, baby. Are we awake? Hi. 
Hello. <laughs> oh my goodness, you are so cute. You are so cute. Oh, bless you. Hey, hello. I wanted to be born in the middle of the night. Like my Grammy said that I would. I didn't, you didn't make it to three. But you were close. Yes. Huh. <laughs> Look at that cute little thing. Hello, baby. Do I dare to look if you're a little girl or a boy? Do I even dare to look? Of course you are. A little boy. <laughs> what a good, good job you're doing. Hello, baby. You're doing so good. Oh, that's another one. That's another one. Oh, oh gosh. Hello. Mother's Day. Oh, what a gift to your mama. Aren't you guys? Aren't you a gift to your mama? Hey, happy Mother's Day, mommy. Did you kiss me? Oh, what a cute mom kissing her babies. I know. I'm trying. Hold on. There you are. Is that better? Good job. <laughs> Of course, this is another little boy. Good job, Ati. Hello, you cuteness. Hello. Hello. Oh, you did such a great job, Ati. Yes, ma'am. The only part I don't understand is why it had to be at 2 a.m. Yeah. Although she could have totally dealt with this by herself. Uh, she... Oh, look at this baby. Hello, baby. Hello. Oh, he is trying to nurse from her collar. Hello! Hi, 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 hi! He like that make it up. He like that make it up. He 
Hello, sweetness. No, I'm not your mom, so I don't have anything to give you. Oh, you're hopping like a bunny? Well, that's, that's cute, but that's ne unnecessary. That's not necessary. It was midnight, and we were both falling asleep. Um, Athene and I. She was having contractions, dealing with the contractions, and then she wanted to fall asleep. Hello. Um, mom, he's looking for something. He's looking for something. Mommy, you want to get up? He's like, nope. Mm, you're so cute. You're so cute. Oh my goodness. A lot of work for a little thing. Isn't it? Isn't it, boys? Isn't it a lot of work for your mama? Well, hopefully she'll get up soon. You want to get up, Athene? Athene? Do you want to get up, mama? Feed your babies? He's like, yes, please. You're such a cute boy. Your mommy and your daddy, they love to throw... A cute little silver, huh? You guys know how to do that, don't you? He is a true silver, though. With some white. This little boy right here, I don't know what he's going to end up looking like. Because he... I, th I don't think he's going to be black. I don't think so. I think it's just dark because he's wet. Oh my goodness, he is so cute. He has this cute color. Oh, we'll see in the morning when he's dry. You want to try to find your mama teeth? They, they're hungry, Athene. Can we feed them, mama? Look, they're boys. They're born hungry. Mama. You gotta feed them. They need to drink. Can you do it again? Can you find it? Right here. Right there. Come on, little man. You can do this. Yeah. You can do it. You got the other teeth. You got it. You got it. <laughs> this is the hardest part. The one that takes forever when they're first fresheners. At least this year, that was my experience. It takes them a good minute. Oh, come on, sir. You can do this. You can do this. I think he's going to look like Denali's pattern. You know how she has this black in the back? But they're not true Cuclairs. But look at that face. He's so cute. Look at that face. Oh goodness. Life is good. They both had a little bit of colostrum, but I'm gonna try to insist a little bit more until I know they got it. And then I'm gonna leave them with mom uh, it's a really nice night oh I know I know sweet girl what you don't know which one to take care of they're both yours they're just in different spots Hi. Do you remember my voice? You do? I was saying hello, baby. I was saying hello, baby. And you were in your mama belly. Ah, oh, Grammy, please stop. Making me blush. I'm a big boy now. Oh, what a big boy. 
What a cute big boy. Look at that one. I love the marking on his face. Let's see if I can show you. He has the cutest little markings. He has a white pole. But look at all the weird white, brown, light cream markings he has in his face. You're very cute too. Don't worry about it. You have no problem being cute. You're very, very cute. Yes, you're very, very cute. <sighs> Can't believe she had two beautiful boys. That's all right. There's always next year. Oh, I'm not disappointed, little boy. Just don't think for a minute that I'm disappointed in the cuteness that you are. I know. And I love this part. When the babies look at me in the eyes like, I know you're saying something to me. Yes, I love it. Oh, I think you're a little jealous, Mama, aren't you? <laughs> <laughs>